She was saying, for those of you who know Dante or the famous writing Dante's Inferno, they think he was built or he was born in this complex of apartments in this house. Good morning. It's very early. It's about 6.30 a.m. Hmm. Packed up last night. It's our last day here in, or our last few like minutes here in, v or in Venice. We're gonna catch the ACTV to the train and then we're taking the train station to Florence. And uh, yeah, then our time in Florence starts. Really excited. The first leg of the Italian trip, done. Cases are back to going through hell on the cobblestone. Just hope that the ACTV is working. Yeah, the, the ACTV Vaporetto water taxi system, we are water bus system, water metro, whatever you want to call it. We are really hoping it's working this morning. Otherwise, we're gonna have to walk a mile and a half like this to the train station. And a mile and a half doesn't seem bad until you're rolling over cobblestones. So, fingers crossed. Man, Venice in the morning is stunning. Oh my God. The ACTVs are back up and running. Apparently I read that they, um, they do a strike every March 8th for International Women's Day, which doesn't really make much sense to me because then the women can't ride it. Anyway, <laughs> they're back up and running this morning and I'm very thankful. And one is hopefully about to pull up. Slowly coming to a halt. We are at our stop. We are in Florence, baby Firenze. After we arrived in Florence, we made our way through the beautiful sun kissed alleys to our very special Airbnb. All right, so we're here. Uh, our building is a tall, very old building. Um, each floor. She said that each floor was built at like a different time, so the staircases are all different. They're like winding. Yep, and we had four flights of very tight winding steps to go up <gasps> with these two right here. They're not like insanely heavy, like I can carry it. It's just hard when it's a tiny circus and you're like trying to get up and... Yep, let's do a quick a tour, Crack. Okay, so also I wanted to say she was saying, for those of you who know Dante or the famous writing Dante's Inferno, they think he was built or he was born in this complex of apartments, in this house. Yeah. Which is very cool. The original home of Dante Alighieri. Oh, oh yeah. Who okay. seems cool. to- She's saying it's very old. Like this place is very, medieval. very old. Medieval. Yeah, yeah, she said it was built in medieval times, around when Dante would have been alive. All right, give us the tour, Kaka. It's a small place. It's small. It's so cute though. And the host is amazingly nice. Like I love her. She made me like Florence like instantly. Okay. This is our little bedroom. You can see the medieval wooden ceiling, kind of similar to what we had in Venice, which is making me realize our place in Venice was really old too. We have a nice little bed. We got one of those cool pillows that you can do <laughs> this with. Anyway, she left us little chocolates, which is nice, little Eastern candies and some candies right here. But yeah, that's the bedroom digs. And then in here is the cute little kitchen with very tall ceilings. Yeah. yeah, just a little tiny place, but it's homey. It's really homey. And it's then this tight. is our itty bitty Amy size bathroom. Come on in, Marsh. So she had said. Oh, it's long though. That this shower is only 50 centimeters wide, but I mean, I don't think it 
seems that bad. Let me try Marsh. and stuff in there. Marsh was worried. He was like, I'm not going to fit. No, I, I was mean, like, I, I, can, I can fit he like can this fit way perfectly. 100%. Can you fit widthwise? No. And it's like to your shoulder. You're going to have to like put it over you. Here, does this. Oh, perfect. Perfecto. See? Is it just like turned on right now? <laughs> it's just like, pfft. he's going to be fine. No big deal. All right, perfect. This is like the cute rest of the bathroom. There's the toilet, of course. We're in Emily, so there's a bidet. Sink. Things you you straightener. You know you're in Italy when okay. you see two things. One, mocha pot. They're Let tea. Your your home espresso. They're always in these Italian places. And one key. Two essentials in an Italian home. <laughs> Yeah, we're really happy to be in Florence. We're curious to see if this next leg of the trip is gonna solidify how much we like Italy or what's gonna happen. So I already think we're gonna like Florence at least as much as Venice, if not more. All right, we're venturing out into Florence for the first time. We're both just like kind of tired. We're like a little burned out, honestly. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna go to this kind of famous sandwich shop, grab some sandwiches and then go back to the go back to the Airbnb and continue to rest and recharge. All right, so we just got our sandwiches. Cracks got two of them, got one. We got three just to taste everything. Um, and, uh, yeah, they were super friendly, super nice. We'll probably be back. They made the, you ordered and they made the sandwiches just right there in front of you. Pressed them in a hot press. I have a feeling this is gonna be the best thing we've had in Italy so far. Me too. Everyone in Florence has been so nice so far. The food looked super fresh and super delicious. And just the energy in there felt really good. And the sandwiches looked bomb when they were making them. So I am very excited for this. Okay, let's take a good look at the okay. sandwiches crack. I got the flag because it's red, green, and white. The bread is like nice and warm and crispy. Pasta. Mine had like salami, mozzarella, spinach, pesto, tomato. Okay, let's pull mine out. So I got the oh. poker. I don't remember what the poker even is. Looks like the poker is spicy salami, fontina cheese, peppers, spinach, and hot sauce. Do you want all of it right now? Yeah, dude. Actually, or do you just want to yeah. save? Okay, so that's the poker right here. And then this is the bomba, right? Mm hmm. This is the bomba. And he's pulling out the bomba. It's very messy. And that one has spicy salami, pecorino. Sunbread tomato and hot sauce. That's bomb. We're gonna watch some Harry Potter and get down on this builder. Wow. How is it? Best thing I've been in. Let me see the inside of a bite. All right. It's good, Aim? Yeah. And such good value. Like, it was cheap. Like, I think for three sandwiches and a spread, it was like 16 bucks or something. 16 mm -hmm. euros. Mm. Oh, good crunch. That's the bomba. So this is the bomba. She looks saucy. Yum. Mm. <laughs> is it not amazing? Mm. I can't help myself I'm like eating behind the camera because it's so freaking good. So the bread, like you can definitely tell it's fresh baked, like today. I think it's there's, focaccia, maybe. There's big things of cheese in there. The meat actually has some spice to it. Mm -hmm. Amy and I have been really craving spice. There's nothing like with any good spice or really flavor in Venice that we tasted. This is, for just being like a little sandwich shop, this is absolutely incredible. The flavor is insane. Try the other one. That is delicious. All right, let's try this one. This one's got a little bit of spinach. It's a Look lot. It's a lot heavier. Mmm. It's a lot heavier. Oh my god, I'm so excited for this. It's got a bunch of veggies in there. 
Mm. I'm excited to try that one. The spinach has like a good roasted flavor to it. Again, that meat is amazing. A little bit of chard on the bread adds a good flavor into it. That thick layer of cheese. The other thing I like about these sandwiches is they're thin. They're not hard to eat. No, like, yeah. Sometimes you get thick sandwiches and they're hard to eat. This is like thin. They Instead of like it being tall, it's like laid out over a big piece of bread. Oh, this might be our crack. This, this might, might be. be like our everyday lunch up yeah. here. Cause yeah. it, the value is incredible. Like Amy said, all three of these huge sandwiches and a Sprite were 16 euro. So I think it's about 450 to five euros a sandwich, depending on what one you get. But yeah, yeah. we're gonna dig in. Oh, 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 oh,